Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we will give like a basic configuration of the FMC. In the previous videos, we prepared the uh, FTD to be managed by FMC. So, and we booted up the FMC since long time. And I think it's put up and ready for configuration right now. Let me see. Yes, I hope so. Great. So, the initial configuration, okay, there is two types of installation of FMC. In my case, I kept it inside uh, the peanut lab. Uh, some people will uh, prefer to put it inside the uh, VMware workstation itself uh, to avoid the different layer of virtualization and to speed up things. Uh, in my case, actually, I kept it in uh, Peanut Lab uh, to make everything real and uh, not to lost you by thinking that uh, this interface is coming from another management and uh, another interface is inside, so I don't like that. Uh, maybe I will make uh, a video how to install it inside uh, the workstation, uh, the video next of this, so no problem. Let's ask now, we prepare the FTD to be managed by FMC. So let me put the username, the default is admin, the same of FTD. The password is admin A capital, one, two, three. Great. The FMC is uh, totally based on Linux. So if you want to do any configuration, you have to go to li uh, Linux mode. So you will press expert, enter. Here, admin, fire, firepower. Great. You have to be like a little bit good in uh, Linux command. So I want to see the interfaces that I have. So if config. Here is telling me that I have either zero. Yes, either zero. Uh, it means the diagnostic, the management one. And by default, it's 192.168.45.45. This is what I want to change. So. To change it, it's f config 192.168, no, sorry, f config and give it the uh, interface e0.0, so 192.168.100.2. The net mask it will take it by uh, default. Press enter. Operation not. Uh, permitted operation not permitted okay why let's see if config either zero one nine two dot one six it's stuck. It's weird. Okay. I just let me. Okay, less interruption. Of this is the hardest for the FMC. I don't know why it's stuck. Just give me a second. So what I did is just I restarted. So again, expert. Let's issue this command sudo minus, no, it's not accepted. Okay, f config either 0, 192.168.100.2, it must 0. Okay, operation not permitted. <clears throat> Weird. Mm, okay, let me exit. So do. Okay, admin, admin123, 
Okay. Expert. <coughs> it should ask me here for a password. I don't know why it's not asking me for a password on the text. Okay, server minus i. Okay, now. Great. Admin, one, two, three again. Okay, F config. A there is zero. One nine two dot one six eight dot one hundred dot two. Okay, now it's accepted. It has to after expert it we have to make like a sudo minus i, it means super user do and interface the i is interface okay fine so if config now uh yes it took it let's see the pc here management pc let's boot it up test one two three okay let me give it Let's start later. Let me do one thing here. Securing resolution. Uh, okay. Okay, it changes. Okay. Fine. That's bigger. Let me give it IP address from the same range. So. 192.168.100.10 eight, um, eight, no problem okay let's ping the FMC 192.168.100.2 perfect it's pinging so and the three Three also is pinging, great, four is pinging. So the FMC and FCD is pinging. So let me open the <coughs> Firefox. And to see the basic configuration for that, HTTPS 192.168.100.2. This is the FMC. Great, it's advanced down add exceptions confirm mm -hmm. pretty good so username is admin password is admin a capital still we are in the default now it will ask us to uh, start the changing and for the initial configuration great now it's saying you the new password you will put new password as what you want of course here there are like some criteria you care about it one two three okay uh, press next now this is the agreement that you will make accept for it great now what what's here it's fully qualified domain name okay for it by default, it's Firepower. No, I want it FMC. Um, using static, yes, static. Gateway, make the gateway 192.168.100.1. Okay, here DNS group. This is the Cisco umbrella DNS. And this is the public IP address. It's validating, it's asking for internet, but there is no internet right now. Don't care about it. Just click finish. Yeah, much faster, much faster. Okay, great. He believed that I don't have internet. Now, great. Now, FMC is ready. It will issue for you here the license. 
if you have a license, of course, you will register your license from the Cisco. But because this is for a training purpose, here if you can see, start 90 day evaluation period without registration. Great. I can do that and I have to do that actually. This is one thing mandatory to add an FTD device. If I, skip, if I press skip and start to adding FTD, it will fail. You have to enable this license. So Cisco will give you like as a trainee and 90 days for evaluation period. So click in it and click save. Great. Now it's building up. Very good. Now this is the dashboard and it automatically will send you to the devices to assume that you are going to add a device. Great. We will do this later. But now what FMC is doing, because FMC is connected to the internet and is getting the updates from Talos and of course third party. Uh, so it's always trying to send uh, like a keep alive for the internet that I am there or not to uh, build up the exact license that you deserve okay to implement the AM, the intelligence, uh, the uh, IPS, the application control etc. So actually uh, this is the build up of the FMC uh, please don't uh, forget to subscribe and share and like and uh, wait for me for another video thank you very much